Welcome to Neurology News Network. I'm Alicia Pajika. Let's get into the news from this week. New recommendations from the European Medicine Agency's Committee for Medicinal Products for Human Use call for the removal of pregnancy contraindications for two interferon beta treatments, Plegrity and Avonex. The recommendation was based off of data from several national health registries that demonstrated no increased risk for major congenital anomalies with exposure to the drug, as well as no harmful effects on breastfed newborns. Data presented at the 2019 International Congress of Parkinson's Disease and Movement Disorders showed positive results with oral tavipadon, an investigational drug being studied in patients with Parkinson's disease. The drug, which resulted in a nine-point reduction in the unified Parkinson's disease rating scale score, could potentially serve as monotherapy in early-stage disease, as well as adjunct therapy to levodopa for patients with late-stage disease. The agent, which also showed a favorable tolerability and safety profile, will enter into phase three development in 2020. Also at the meeting, new data on pimavanserin was presented, demonstrating the drug's positive effects on depressive symptoms in patients with Parkinson's disease. Results from the phase two open-label study found that pimavanserin, which is approved and marketed as Nuplazid for Parkinson's psychosis, showed that patients who received the study drug as monotherapy or as adjunct therapy to SSRI or SNRI therapy, reported significant improvements in scores on the Hamilton Depression Rating Scale as early as the second week. For more direct access to expert insight, head to neurologylive.com. This has been Neurology News Network. Thanks for watching.